Wait a minute. Hmm? Let me look at you. Yes. You know what? You like me. Well, I wouldn't get as wildly emotional as that, but I must say I've had a lovely day. And it's much to be said for picnics on the Caribbean. I made an impression, huh? Well, you offer something to a fellow, sweetie. Yes? Like the way you pack a lunch basket. And the way you keep the sandwiches coming. Slave, forget and... about food, huh? I mean, there's just you and me, and I've got that lost in the tropics, oh, so defenseless feeling blues. Honey, now, why do you want to spoil an afternoon like that? Why do you... <laughs> Unpuck her, baby. You looking for something? You know what that is? Never saw him before. Who is it? How's it going, boy? No. Yeah. Wit? You're doing fine, boy. Wit Fonimo. <laughs> it sure is. You jolted? Yeah, I'm jolted. Golly, no wonder. <laughs> you know how many years it's been since I've seen this joker? You got any idea? Oh, uh, what's your name, baby, so as I can introduce you? It's Miss Poe. Della Poe. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Poe? Slave Shannon. You his, girlie? Why don't you ask him? Ooh, you got yourself a real tigress this time, boy. What are you doing in Trinidad, Whit? Oh, uh, I'm with her, with Miss Poe. Miss Poe? You sure that's the right name, baby? <laughs> Della. <laughs> what do you want? And I've been looking for you, Slate, for years. Just to let you know I'm alive. Ain't I? <laughs> <laughs> Cut it out. <laughs> sure. Oh, it's all right that I'm with her, Shannon. My wife's dead. I'm sorry to hear that. Thanks a lot. She died while I was a prisoner of war. Did you know I was taken prisoner, Slate? No, I thought you were killed. Him? <laughs> they can't kill me, can they, baby? Oh, not you. <laughs> well, Slate, mm -hmm. I just wanted to let you know I was around. I want to tell you something, Whit. I guess I'm glad you're alive, but I'm not glad you're here. Huh. Are you now? Let me tell you about your boy. Back up, Buster. Just back up. Why don't you tell her then about Korea? Tell her the good part, how you chicken. How you were sent to take me and my sergeant out of that ambush and your chicken ran. How many men did you have? I never did know. Fifteen men. Oh, you could have made it, boy. You had the guts, you could have gotten us both out of there. Whatever happened to the sergeant? Dead. Everybody's dead, Shannon. Everybody. Come on, honey bunch, let's get out of here. What do you see in a man like him, sis? <laughs> Sailor, the way it happened, the thing that he's talking about in Korea, you see, it was a question of sacrificing 15 men to save two. And there wasn't a chance of it succeeding. Baby. And I had to make a decision. And you made it, I know. And you made the right decision. So that's the end of it. Now take me home. No, it's not the end of it. Come on. And that's the kind of a man he was, King Moses. I guess he was a good soldier because he had the instincts of a killer. And now he's found you. I remember once seeing him empty a whole machine gun clip into a man he'd already killed with the first bullet. I repeat, Mr. Slade. Hmm? And now he's found you. Yeah. Yes, he has. That's why the gun? He's a bad boy, King. What do you think he'll do, Mr. Slade? Well, I think he had a madness in him before Korea. But since then, he's gone through too much. 
His wife dying, prisoner of war. Tell you something else, my dear Inspector Coburn. You know what I'm going to do to him? I'm going to kill him Shannon, on this... sight. I walk out of here and I see him standing on the corner. I'll shoot him dead. I walk into a drugstore and he's sipping a chocolate ice cream soda. I'll put a gun to his head and I'll pull the trigger. Then I'd have to arrest you for murder. Well, it'll be worth it. What do you think it'll avail you, Shannon? Coming in here and telling the police you're going to kill a man? I want you to try to stop me. Oh, tell no, I'm serious. I want you to try to stop me, and I'll tell you something else. I'll tell you exactly how to do it. No. Pick up with Bonamo and throw him off this island. Why? Why? Are you crazy enough to sit there and ask me no, why? No, throw your weight about in here, Shannon. This is a crown colony living under a set of laws, and my function here your is to... Your function is to see that people don't put snakes in other people's bedrooms. I don't know what the crown colony laws say about a thing like that. Will you let me finish? All right, then finish! Thank you. Well, go ahead and finish. There is no proof whatsoever that this man you're talking about had anything to do with what happened to Mr. Wilde. Therefore, I can do nothing. Therefore, now, don't give me any of that therefore jazz, Inspector. If there's anything I can't stand today, it's any of that vicious therefore jazz. How is Mr. Wilde? How would you be? Shaken. Well, she calls it unglued. If we believe her, I'm sorry. I'll let her know. Look, Inspector, this is a dangerous man. He thinks I'm responsible for every lousy thing that's happened to his life, and he wants to pay me back for it. Me and all the things that I'm fond of. Now, Shannon... Now, look, Inspector, don't say it. Don't say Shannon, don't do anything rash. Please don't say it. He's here on a legitimate visa. I can't put him off the island, not without cause. Is that your final word? Final word. Okay. Can I help you, sir? Nope. Feeling better, ladies, sir? Books balance? I don't know. Can't concentrate, huh? Well, I wouldn't be able to concentrate. What is it, Lady Sailor? King Moses, it's him. It's Whit. The man who was with Flight in the Army. Hi, boy. What can I do for you, mister? I asked you a question. What are you doing here? How are you feeling? Feeling pretty good, huh? How's the little lady inside? I think you better leave. I think you better leave and never come back here. You forgot her else. That's right. Hey, that's pretty neat. <coughs> <coughs> How do you feel? Terrible. There's not any worse. What happened? I got beat up. With with Bonimo, okay? With Bonimo, huh? Where'd he go? I don't know. 
you get him inside, sailor? Mr. Slate? Yeah? I don't need you to fight my battles. Ah, uh, well, you took a crack at him. You didn't do so good. I shouldn't have waited this long. Where do you think you're going? With you. Out. Come on, out, out. to go along with me, didn't you? Oh, yes. Where would you have sat if you'd gone with me? I would have sat... right there. Oh, would you hold me, please? 